is that guy Udi here back with another video so y'all see the title we about to work on the 2005 acura rl uh, brakes and rotors so let's get to it so the things you would need are the brackets for your brakes i already did the uh left side so we want to work on the right side the uh, passenger side so brackets uh grease so i just bought this this a uh, three eighths uh, racket wrench it came up to like 160 got one year warranty on it so i decided to get that we got a three-fourth clamp dw40 wire brush a hammer we got the brakes and yeah that's all and then it's the rotor right here so let's get to it you wanna take this pin off right here there's a pin in the back There's this pin right here, you want to remove that. Just the pin, remove that. So there's pin, so you want to just hammer it out. There's two pins. Because when you get one off, you could take, you could use the other pin to take the other one off. Those pins gonna give you a hard time to take out so spray wd-40 like and then just knock it back and forth so it can loosen up see the, the bottom one comes out you want to use the hammer and the plier. Yeah, try to knock it back in and out. Get it. Yeah, that will help. Bingo. So we got the first one out. To get the second one out, you want to use this as a thing for the other side. If you get in there. And then take the one that's in the back off that you try to use because it will get stuck but you do the same method to take it out so we got both of them away from the car so let's get these loose and then we're gonna use the the wrench the ratchet the ratchet we're gonna use that to loosen it This is a metal hole, so this will be fine just dangling. And you're able to take that off. So we got it off. This is the old one. Put that to the side. And then we are able to take the brake pads off. So let me grab a flathead. They still got enough meat, like they got meat on them still. 
So I don't know why it was making that noise, but we got new brakes, so we're gonna put them in anyways. So now you wanna grab your wire brush. You'll need a uh, brake cleaner. You wanna clean these, clean that off right there. Like I try to take these off, but they snap my uh, T15. You don't even gotta remove this, just clean it up. Spray brake cleaner on it. Wipe it down. You got your degreaser or your lubricant onto the bracket you just cleaned. That's where the brake pads go. So. Now you want to put the new brake pads in. So this goes towards the front of the car, the hose. And then you want to put the bolts back in. Out. Don't put the second one in. Take one out. Just put one. Because <clears throat> we're going to have to. Because we're going to have to put this on the side. Or in the back of it. So let's grab our rotor. Oh, there's our little like screw holes. So I usually match it to the screw holes that's on this. I'm gonna do it like this. Like that. Right there. If the caliper don't like fit on this, that means you gotta use your clamp. And separate it out. Bingo. Got that in. So now you want to put the bolts back in. You want to do it by hand first so you won't strip the bolt. Just enough where you're able to get it. And then now you want to put this in. So, let me show y'all the way you put it in. You put the bracket in. So you go, push that, the middle one in first, and then it goes straight in. And then you get the, you get the bolt, the bottom. Push it in. I'm trying to do this with one hand. And then you put, push that in, right? And then, and you get it. You get what I'm trying to do. Just like how that one is. So they're in all the way because I know the hammer can't reach that little tiny spot. Now it's time to put the wheel back on. So that would be how you install brakes and rotors on a, a 05 Acura RL. Yeah, so please like and subscribe. Peace out.